Salutations, this is Grim Devel, and welcome back to our Let's Play of Dungeon Crawl Stone Soup. We are Grim Devel, the Swashbuckler. Uh, I guess because our short blade skill is 15, and the highest skill that we have, although we are getting stealth up to 15 and shields up to 15. Um, although that would still keep Swashbuckler if we just keep those at 15. At some point, our fighting skill will probably surpass that, though. We'll see. Um... Our armor and dodging may also as well. We have not been training more dodging, but we probably will next, honestly. Uh, we're at dungeon 12. Our willpower is only one, and we don't have other sources of willpower. Uh, right, we have a source of negative willpower. Um, so we're going to keep going down in dungeon. Dungeon 13, feeling very powerful. Uh, we'll try to avoid this manticore. Can it open doors? No. And it is banished, and we are level 15. More dex. All right, we got our dexterity back that we lost from wearing our helmet. We are flying, so we can just fly over this dark, wa deep water. Let's see if we can't stab this eel. Oh. Um, I'm more interested. I'm more worried about the demonologist now. Let's go for the demonologist. Oh, wait, we need Aralek if we're going to be surrounded by these things. Okay, Demonologist is gone. Okay. Good. All right, put Evasion back on. We we're keeping the Ring of the Mage for the time being because we are now um, learning some translocations. All right. All right, let's, let's keep... Let's try to maintain our chance to uh, stab these things over here. That's just a four-headed Hydra. No problem. Nice! Five Ice Blast charges and an Antique Armor Emporium. Hmm. With Artifact artifact Ruined Ring Mail. Uh, it's cheap enough. I'm just going to buy it. Okay. Plus four Ring Mail that gives our Corrosion and our F+. Plus. Uh, if it gave regen, we already have our corrosion on our head. We don't have a source of RF, except for the chain mail of fire resistance. And this might be a good alternative to that. Um, in fact, let's test it out. Let's go to the stairs just as a safeguard. Um, if I can get to the stairs. Okay. So... 1889, uh, and also five pips of stealth. Um, the chain mail uh, increases AC by six, lowers evasion by, f by uh, five. So a net increase, um, but of course it ruins our stealth. Um, is not affecting our um, the time it takes to hit. I think that must just be from shields and not armor. Okay, the ring mail uh, increases our AC from our baseline by four, lowers evasion by one. I think that's an even higher net increase. And of course our stealth is still five pips there. So, Let's see, so wait, so this is 39 total, right? And the chain mail is 37. Yeah, yeah, Okay, I'm going to put our tr our uh, troll armor back on, and we're going to drop the chain mail. We really don't need that anymore. The ring mail is a better alternative, just all around. Cool. All right, Cyclops, come to me. Uh, we are marked. All right, let's try to make our way back to the stairs. Oh, gosh. Okay. All right, this is fine. Go up, wait till the mark disappears, and go down a different staircase. It's too bad because it woke a lot of creatures up that we now can't stab. But what are you going to do? Um... I think that we only have one... Yeah, we only have 
three more opportunities for to use scrolls of identify. Um, so it's silly that we have six, but what you know, it's fine. Nice pin cushion. It's a ZZ Top song, pin cushion. Hello, yes. I love it. I love stabbing them while they're sleeping. All right, devoured. Uh, very large slime creature, huh? Okay. I don't love this. Can slimes go across deep water? They sure can. No, I don't like it. Are they slow when they're that big? Why isn't it do it? It's not moving. I don't know. I don't get it. Um, you know what? Just throw some poison at it. Is that blink? Oh, I can cast blink. Right. Um, poison. Let's get away from the, uh, there. I just want it to separate. There we go. Okay. Uh, we got more polymorph charges, it looked like. Human. What's a human doing here? Oh, this must be the uh, entrance to vault. Yep. What? I don't love the dispersal trap there. I'm trying to avoid that. Do you have anything that we want? No. Ooh, you did hit us for more than I'd like. Especially if we're being just one thing on our own. I mean, these things are intentionally tough for this point. All right, come at me. Still, we're, you know, one-on-one, -on -one, we are definitely winning pretty handily here. Just got to throw it so he sees us. <laughs> Stabbed. Pin cushioned. Um, what is all this stuff? Cloud of rain? What do you have? Okay. It's also good to check, not just to see if they have anything that we want, but I, I should be doing that with every character anyway, because sometimes they can have very powerful weapons that I'm just not seeing, right? And then I get into, like a one-on-one -on -one melee battle with them. And uh, the human was devoured by a tear, and I did not see if they had a really good shield. Um, where is it? The human... A human comes into view. No, I think it would have said if it had anything really cool, but it did have a kite shield um, that is now in the abyss. Same do I'm still doing even as I'm talking about making sure that I'm looking at people's equipment, I'm failing to do so. Um, okay. Our willpower is still one pip. We still don't have any sources of willpower. It looks like we're going to dungeon 14. Okay. Nice. All right, we're going to get to the warrior because those things can do a lot of damage. Are we, we keep blinking it. Which is bad. Got to get rid of the Bogart too. This is not a great situation, to be honest. We killed it. We got to kill these Bogarts. Bogarts? Bogarts. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and Curari this thing. Oh, gosh. Yeah, that's from, those are from the Bogarts. I want to go back up the stairs. We're going to go this way. 
Okay, we're fine. Uh, I cure the thing because I didn't. I wanted it slow. Okay. So it wouldn't uh, hit us. Wouldn't be able to follow us to the stairs. Uh, boots. Yeah, we have plus two boots. Uh, that is a demon uh, pitchfork. Demonic demon trident, right? That's what's called. I can't believe I called it a demon pitchfork. Pyromancer. Um, right, we don't have any RF. We just gotta get out of here. We'll let it get close to us. And then, yeah. Magic bite. Oh, that was all that was in here? Disappointing. Harpies. Um, for us, might be okay. They can be a little scary. Five charges of Ice Blast. I know there are boggarts around here. And the Boggarts, uh, as you saw, they summon. If you can kill the Boggart, you will kill the summons. But they can cast a lot of summons and block your path to them. There we go. There we go. Alright, Harpy time. Let's see how we do. Usually they are in groups. Glad to see just one. Harpies have batty movement. All right, these things will just poison. They are very susceptible to poison. <laughs> and I banished it to the abyss. Okay. Okay, so we still only have one Pip of Will. We only have one floor of dungeon left. And honestly, like... I don't love, like, doing this before we even do Orc. Last floor dungeon, I feel it can get scary. Uh, we can fly, so this is all fine here. Flying over lava and water. An interesting little part of the map. See if we can't stab the Tenga Warrior, and we can. Um, Blink is certainly online. Um, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and change... I don't like that Manifold Assault as before Passage of Galubri. I'm going to change those. There we go. I did that with the equals button. Those playing at home. Um, we got a... There's a scroll of blinking. An orc sorcerer. All right. Nice. Nice. Good. Uh, there's depths. How many scrolls of blinking do we have? Two. Well, sorry, three. I didn't realize we didn't pick that up. Um, I just realized I didn't check the Necromancer's spell list, and it could have banished us. Especially since we have very low willpower, which is why we're here. Although it's also maybe why we shouldn't be here. Uh, I'm going to put on Aurelek. What do you have? Glaive of Freezing. Uh, I will put on a uh, ring of protection from cold. Okay, immediately banished him to the abyss. Um, all right, killed something invisible. I don't have any RF, but it was just one fire ugly thing. It was okay. Atropa. Atropa? Atropa? Um, 
That does take another slot. So it's a question of whether or not we want to keep that. It can be powerful because it confuses people, or it, it blinds them, technically. But very few things are actually susceptible to it. So we may end up just dropping it, even though we've trained up some throwing. Uh, our throwing at being at six means our um, uh, darts are at min delay. Uh, okay. The warrior there, um, the orc warrior can fury other orcs. So we want to try to keep the other orcs away from its screen. We want to keep it confused. What do you have? A broad axe of flaming. Okay, I don't care about that. Well, that could hurt us a lot, actually. Um, all right, if we get in trouble, we know... that we can Serpent Slash. Which, like I said, we have not used Serpent Slash or Heavenly Storm at all, so our piety has just stayed at max. I really should be using the ability more. Ew, Agnes. Um, with a Lajatang of Speed, a very powerful weapon. Well, the Lajatangs are already fast. It seems excessive. Um, it's like a quick blade of speed. Like, you want to, but you want, like, if it was electric... We, or distortion. Like, that would be amazing. Um, underestimate her at your peril. She can hit for up to 47 damage with her weapon, and it's a very fast weapon. Um, so that's really deadly. Can we sneak? Um, I was afraid of that. I was thinking about maybe even Serpent Slashing up to her, which I probably should have done. Um, she's scary. I'm going to use the Box of Beast to distract her. Oh, we got a, a mature Bat Weird Beast. Okay, she's dead. I think that was helpful. Um... Yeah, she was getting constricted. She was getting confused by it. Well, while we have it, let's try to explore as much as possible. Yeah, helpful. Thank you, Bat Weird Beast. All right, it disappeared. I think that was a good use of it. Oh, there's an orc warlord in there. There's got it. Yeah, there's a ghost, um, and some ruined cloak. That I'm sure is nice, but probably not worth the risk right now. We'll try to get that later. Um, Chuar Cloak is just a plus zero cloak. Um, willpower is still just one and still no other sources. So at this point, we're just going into orcs, uh, orcish mines. Um, shields is at 11. Let's see. Um, 18, 18, 10. And if I put on the kite shield, 18, 17, 13. But we are attacking, still attacking more slowly. All right, keep wearing the buckler for now. Shield just going up a little more slowly than I like. Oh, let's get armor. Armor is still being trained. Or sorry, we still have the book for it, so let's keep training it. We're going to keep doing it until it runs out, and then we'll just go dodging. Jewelry shop. Hmm. Wait, what amulet are we wearing? Oh, regen, right? Yeah. Um, so the argument against Acrobat is that Acrobat, when you're doing your like movement attacks with your Rujian movement attacks, you don't get the Acrobat bonus. So it kind of makes Acrobat, it kind of like nerfs Acrobat a little bit. Is there more poison resistance, but we don't need that. We already have that. Yeah, none of this is useful. Check this out. Nothing. Okay. Hello, ogre. Love it. Like a kebab. Like a kebab. All right. Go down. Bring some folks over to us. 
You know what? Yeah, I'm going to have more folks come. Nice. That was amazing. Although here I do, I should pay more attention to what they're using. Uh, not only because there might be stuff I want and also stuff that I should be afraid of. The game does pause um, if a weapon, if someone wielding a distortion weapon appears. Okay, there's a knight. So we're going to flee. We don't want a knight around all those orcs and going to berserk all of them. It is just a plus two Bardish. I mean, Bardish are really, really strong weapons. They are the strongest polearm. All right, we're going to go up and wait for their fury to run out. I waited 10 ticks. That was enough. What do you have? Um, okay. Yeah, because these, these orcs have a lot of magic stuff. That's one of the reasons you come to orc. Uh, yeah, I want to get, get back because of... Oh, this is a staircase we haven't explored. Keep going. Okay. Uh, smite will still get us. Okay. Neither of those are orcs, so I'm not afraid of orcish fury. Um, it got banished, and I should have checked its weapons. I forgot. You can usually see, like, on the token when someone has a magic weapon. I shouldn't be standing at a staircase that I don't know where it leads. Okay, now let's check this out. I'm not looking at their weapons. Um, okay, this is all, no one has anything good here. I am just, man. I'm tearing through all of them. I mean, part of that is that we... I usually don't go to the Orcish Mines this late, so we're more powerful than usual. Um, cancellation's good. I'm just going to mark things for now. Haste, invisibility, might. I don't care about brilliance or attraction or leg. Okay. Um, blinking. I'm going to go ahead and buy that blinking scroll. And the Enchant Weapon Scroll. I will mark the Enchant Armor Scroll. Uh, scrolls of Summoning. I'm going to mark the Scrolls of Summoning. Okay. We're immediately going... Oh. Um, Got to drop stuff. Let's drop Atropa. I'm never... It's never we're never going to use it effectively. I've tried in the past. Pick up Enchant Weapon... Boom. Well, we have a slot, so let's just pick up the attribute for now. Um, uh, the reason I'm not buying those summoning scrolls yet is because there are going to be more shops in Orcish Mines 2, and uh, we want to save our money until we can see what's there. Silver Boomerang. But our pack is full. Um, I mean, if there are going to be more Silver Boomerangs, I would like those. All right, let's drop magical power for now. Pick up a silver boomerang. Ah. All right, I'll mark that other scroll of enchant armor. We don't need the ring of flight, but I would like to rem remember that it's here. Uh, Phantom mirror also. Um, I, Do we already have a wand of digging? We do. That might be all we need for now. Okay. Look, is that a triple a uh, uh, triple sword? Plus one triple sword of flaming, and plus one plate armor, and there's a moth of wrath in there, and an orc warlord with an anti magic great sword. Anti magic is not good for us because it removes our magic. Uh, it takes away like all of those bonus hit points. This is a very ooh. Conjurations. We don't care. Okay. This is a very dangerous vault for us. A vault of uh, um, 
who's the god? Um, tr uh, t -t Trog. We're not going to go into that vault for a very long time, if ever. It would be very foolish. Okay. Um, did I just see... I thought I just saw a vial of floods. Man, there's a lot of stuff here. Did I see a vial of floods? No, my eyes deceived me. I did not see a vial of floods. Okay. Going back down. That was a much bigger um, area than I thought it was going to be. The sorcerers, uh, we are a little worried about. They can paralyze. Which, that's why we wanted our willpower, because of the paralysis. But if we can just... Oh, soul eater. Just kill it as quickly as possible. Okay. All right, this is all fine. Leather armor of willpower. Well, there's a source of willpower. But plus zero leather armor of willpower? Nah. I know I'm not looking at what they're equipping, but... I am looking at their tokens for what it's worth. Uh, let's not go that way yet. Let's try to explore the rest of the area first. Go through here. Yeah, and this just goes all goes right through, I think, that area to the top. Okay. Okay. All right, what do we see? Nothing magic. Uh, right, these, um, we want to kill these priests as soon as possible because they can smite us. Okay. We're doing great. Uh, that is not a summon soul eater. That's just a soul eater. Okay. All right, we're going in. You have something. I, I don't care. I mean, generally, we're not going to care about weapons, right? I should really be looking at the armor, which you can't really see. Boomerangs. I mean, I don't care enough about boomerangs to, like, try to kill you with other means. Plate armor. Uh, there's the... Um, Orc Knight, which... just want to get out of here. Okay. Come here, Knight. If I can kill you... Um... I'm going to try to run away a bit. Kill the Soul Leader. Okay. All right, everyone's calmed down. I love, I love the blood. What are your perforate people and the blood stains? Uh, Inoxinal does iron shot and summon two fatipuses. All right, that's fine. Yeah, right. These uh, ranged attacks aren't very fun for us either. That is where Acrobat would come in handy. What do you have? Scimitar of Electrocution. Uh, I think we can kill you fast enough that it won't matter. Yeah. Tiny bit of a risk. Not much, though. I know there are going to be more. There's probably a Warlord in here, too. Back up. Get out of here. All right, we kill the six fear he. Just kill the summon. It's fine.
Okay. Things should have scattered a bit. Boom. Perforated. Punctured. All right. One of them saw me. Robe of willpower now. The high priest summons. All right. The high priest sees us too. Ooh, can we kill the orc knight before... Okay, good. Yes. Anything here? Okay. Um... Ah, another one. Okay. All right, it sees us and nothing else does. That's good. You don't have anything we care about. We just don't want it um, berserking a bunch of orcs. Okay. Boom. No, I'm just, yeah, the sorcerers are what summon, right? There we go. How did this guy get berserk? Did he drink something? Uh, maybe. I don't know. It's probably in here somewhere. I don't, it doesn't matter. He's dead. Uh, the Sun Demon is not a summon. Demon spawn, huh? I didn't actually look at this demon spawn. It can hit for a lot. It is vulnerable to silver. To remember. Ah. Uh. Trying to kill. Okay. Okay. Boom. Boom. Dagger of Venom. Uh, and here is a uh, gate to Pandemonium, which is why we saw a lot of demons and stuff. Um, nothing good there. Two scrolls of enchant weapon. Um, hold on. That's all we need, right? Well, let's look in the other shop too. Here's another one, but that one costs 105. Whereas this shop, they cost 97. Let's buy those. Um, let's buy another scroll of fear. Uh, let's buy silence. Let's buy summoning. Um, first, all right, we're going to have to drop some stuff. We can drop one ring of protection from cold. We don't need them both. Get the enchant weapon. We're going to read those right now and maximize um, the enchantment. So now our rapier should say, yep, it cannot be enchanted farther, further. Um, this weapon is as good as it's going to get. That is fantastic. Uh, let's pick up that scroll of silence. And we need to drop something else if we want the scroll of summoning, which I do want. Um... What are we dropping? Maybe the Ring of the Mage. Um, poison, vulnerability. Probably vulnerability. Oh, identify. We don't need identify anymore, right? Uh, I don't have any potions that we haven't found. Yeah. Well, whatever. If we find a potion that we don't know, we'll find, we'll come back for the identify potion. Right. We could also drop our enchant armors. Drop those, because we're not going to use them until we're sure we're at our endgame armor. Drop the identifies. Drop the amnesia. Okay, we're fine. Uh, pick up summoning. Okay. Great. Um, so we didn't really find anything great in the shops. Except the scrolls. Um, oh, a ring mail of willpower. That's better. But, again, it's it's kind of underwhelming. 
We want better sources of willpower. Um, okay, let's... Let's see. What do we want to buy here? Um, Scrolls of Fear, very good. I mean, we could afford most of these things. I don't think we're going to worry about the Phantom Mary yet, although it is powerful. It is powerful. Um, cancellation. Let's get that one. Uh, haste. Invisibility. Yeah, just get everything here. This is a good shot. Um, I could see those summoning scrolls being really useful too. That is expensive. But this is what we were waiting to spend our money on. Um, what was the other thing? There's another scroll of fear, right? But we have eight. I think we're fine. Um, we also have four scrolls of blinking, right? Oh, we need five. Uh, there's another scroll of blinking? Oh, in the vault. Okay, we're not getting that one. We, we could consider getting the trove. In fact, if we find another blinking scroll, I am tempted to do that. We're not going to do it right now. All right, we're going to go to the Orcish Mines. That's, sorry, the top of the Orcish Mines. And we've got a plus nine rapier of distortion. Our armor could be better. It's just a plus one troll leather armor. You know, in theory, we could enchant this up to plus four. You know, it's not that exciting. Um, but it does give us regen, and it's sneaky enough. Um, we're still using our armor book. Translocations is getting up to six. Shields and stealth still getting up to 15. Fighting continues. Um, and then we'll probably go in for more dodging. Is what I'm thinking. Uh, we have a little... We've got too much turned on now for me to turn it on, but, um... I think we're good. We're in a good position, and this is this has been a really fun run so far. So the next thing that we have to do is um, the rune vaults. Next episode, we will start on the rune vaults, uh, and that those runes are snake and shoals. Um, shoals, even though we have flying, shoals has a lot of ranged monsters and a lot of open spaces, which does not bode very well for us like open spaces and, and enemies that like keep you at a distance i think shoals is probably the most dangerous rune vault we could get for this character um if we have reflection that's something we might want it is good we ha are a shield user we're gonna have to really think about that and i i think we're definitely gonna do snake first and come out of that and try to come up with a strategy for shoals we don't have to do shoals in theory if we do another, if we do something besides that. Um, but we're definitely going to go to Snake next. And hopefully that won't be too tough. But I've died in Snake a lot, so we'll see. I enjoyed playing with you today, and I'll see you next time. Bye, everybody.